here's the finished product of this particular, here's the other ones, of this particular St. Valentine's Day card using the Crafty Chica TCW stencils. I also used Martha Stewart paper pad and I used the Delusions ink sprays. If I can get it to focus there. I used two colors and I'll show you where I use those in just a moment. I don't use these often because they're really strong and I'm always afraid I'm going to get it all over my fingers like I did there and um, let's see what else I use I used uh, glitter by recollections right here I love this mermaid glitter it's so beautiful and what else did I use I used uh, the I used um, the color shift by plaid what else did I use I use Anna Griffin metal dies I use craft scissors that did uh, an edge to it. This reminds me of Papel Picado. And um, I th I'm trying to think of all the items that I used. Uh, let's see, I'm going to open this up so you can see the inside of the card. And that's what I used the ink spray on, which was the negative or the positive, negative, whatever. It's the actual die cut from the die that I used to make um, my decorative edge around the Sacred Heart. And then I went, it was white paper, I went ahead and sprayed it, and I used it as a decoration for the inside of my card. And I am just so pleased with how these St. Valentine's Day cards came out. They are not the normal cards that I am known for. I'm known, known for more frilly, pink hearts, red. These are totally out of my norm, and I'm loving it. I experimented it today yesterday and today I experimented I crafted and I am in love with my crafting again this is what crafting is to me it 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 is just it's made me so happy to come in here experiment and just craft my heart out literally crafted for my heart out for everyone using these amazing stencils by the crafty chica they totally inspired me and I was fortunate enough to have already this paper this Martha Stewart paper in, in my craft room, and it just all worked so well together with my color shift paints. I actually bought nothing new, to be honest, because I already own this stencil here and this one. I went and bought this again from uh, Kathy's husband, Patrick, who's working in Chumas Art Studio. I think it was yesterday when I went, yesterday, day before yesterday, I don't even remember now. It was day before yesterday, it was Friday. But uh, I already own that one. So really, I bought nothing new. Um, Everything is, I used everything that I already own, which is remarkable because I'm always buying something. So I just want to share with you guys, if you have a chance to pick up these stencils, you can pick them up direct. If you're in Phoenix, you can go down to Munchamas Art Studio in Phoenix and pick up these stencils. You can also order them online, various places. Just Google Crafty Chica Crafts. I'm sure you'll be able to find them. And thank you for looking at my videos looking at my pictures, you know, watching YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, at Juanita's Casita. And, you know, once again, thank you so much. And I just had so much fun. I can't wait for the recipients to get these cards. I'm going to make some more. I don't know if I'm going to continue with this style or go back to my old style, but I had a lot of fun experimenting with these. I actually have one more that I could do like this. I don't know if I'll, if I'll mass produce this one. Um, this may be just one of a kind, Juanita's Casita. Thanks again and happy St. Valentine's Day.